Welcome to Along for the Ride. I'm Marissa. Here's Kyle. Anna's hanging out in the back. We just got to Cedar Point and I just upgraded to the new Prestige Plus Pass. So we are about to take advantage of the preferred parking. We're pretty excited to check this out. I think it's going to be fun to just see what new options there are for us. So Kyle's got this nifty little pink pee pass, which means we got special access. Oh yeah. Okay, so we're getting a real nice close Ooh, spot nice. here. Right. right by the beach. Okay, so we got a spot. We're in like the front row. This is beach parking in front of us. So if you want to get closer, that's beach parking only though. Um, but you can see we got Gatekeeper right in front of us. We were like, hey, we'll be able to see our car if we go on Gatekeeper. It's kind of cool. So. Uh, yeah, this is a really nice parking area, and this lot is essentially empty, so that's pretty sweet. Anna's got a bubble lightsaber. Okay, so our car's parked right over here, and it looks like this little security line is closed, but we're going to basically walk right up to security in the middle here. So that's pretty amazing. Okay, so it is before the park opens. As you can see, quite a lineup here of everybody waiting to get in at 10 when the park does officially open. But because we have season passes, we are good to go right in. Okay, so I just got through uh, the main gate and we went to guest services because I get a fast lane um, plus little ticket here. So I get a little fast lane um, plus thing here. And um, this means I get to go um, in, I get basically I get one of these free every time I come to the park. So right now they um, only have like the tickets available, but soon they're gonna have what they call the button. Um, so for right now we have to stop at guest services each day to grab it, but we have to go there for the parent swap anyways. Anna's getting a picture taken, okay. Um, so so um, I'm excited because I get to go on something right up the exit I think or let me see it says so you just use the fast lane plus entrance there's a specific entrance um, for this I'm so used to parent swap I'm used to going up the exits but um, you can redeem it at Maverick Valraven Millennium Force or Steel Vengeance um, Valraven however is currently closed I think they're waiting on a part um, so they have replaced that with Gatekeeper in the meantime. So I'm excited to be able to hop on one of these rides. Okay, so another perk of having this Prestige Plus Pass is not only do you get a discount on food, but it's a 15% discount. So you can really add up some of those savings between food and merchandise uh, by having that discount. <laughs> benefits that you get for being a prestige pass holder is that you get um, early entry to the water park and there also is a VIP um, section in the water park that you can hang out in so that's a really cool opportunity I know that seats can be hard to come by so to have a, your own VIP section is really really valuable um, especially on a hot summer day like today so definitely something that makes this pass worthwhile. So one of my favorite um, perks about this Prestige Pass is that you get two Bring a Friend tickets for free annually. So especially if you have a family member that doesn't like to go all the time but occasionally wants to go, that can really save you a lot of money in the long run. Um, and I think that's really gonna be beneficial for us moving forward. Um, you also have um, eligibility for um, enhanced pass perks. So you'll get extra little rewards and deals like that and um, you get eligibility for two pre-k passes so that also is a nice perk if you have children Another perk of 
being part of the prestige pass holder I'm gonna call it club is you get the VIP experience in the Millennium Club lounge so we're gonna have to go check that out okay so they have a food truck with a special menu in here that you can't get anywhere else in the park so that's really cool and then they also have like a little uh, bar so you can get beverages as well nice picnic tables they have Jenga and then this area over here, which is super cool, you can just chill and relax. Okay, so this is one of the best parts. You can just chill in this lounge. Thought there was a bug at me. Oh, there goes the Millennium. So you can just chill in this lounge. You can charge your phone, you can watch TV, you can get a drink, you can get some food. It's just like the best place to just relax. It's so comfy, so cozy, and it's quiet, besides Millennium going by occasionally. Um, and also, I feel like if you have kids, this is really, really some place you wanna be. Um, you know, I see there's even like kids over here napping. Like, it's just super relaxing. If you have little babies, this would be a great spot to go. Um, it's just a nice, place that is worth the money especially if you feel like you're going to need some downtime while you're at the park so definitely definitely um worth it to us and um i'm excited to be able to use this for the rest of the season and next season so that's going to be an awesome perk moving forward another fun thing is they have free snacks and water available too so um i'm gonna go check that out here in a moment okay so we got some chips and cookies and then they have water over there as well so this club is open until park close but the food does stop at um, an hour before close so keep that in mind if you're looking to visit here okay so i haven't used my fast lane yet um i'm gonna go use that on millennium here right behind me um, and I just wanted to summarize everything. This pass has been really cool so far. I'm really excited to use it moving forward. I think it's gonna be a lot of fun, a lot more of a relaxing trip. I'm gonna save some money in the long run on like, you know, food and merchandise. Um, and I think, you know, too, just having access to things like the VIP lounge and um, early entry to the park and everything all makes it worth it. I love to bring a friend um, free tickets and i think it's just going to be really great for us as a family especially all the way around um i also just wanted to mention that you do also get access to the water park um and i believe you get early entry to that as well please be sure to check the website for all of the most up-to-date information on all of this including pricing currently um there is the prestige pass and the prestige plus pass so essentially that is if uh, you only want to go to cedar point then you can get just the Prestige Pass. If you plan to go to other Cedar Fair parks, then you will want to get the Prestige Plus Pass. That will get you entry into all of the Cedar Fair parks. Um, I think there's a couple exclusions to that, so pay attention to that on the website, but most of the Cedar Fair parks, and then you also will get the 15% food and merchandise discount at those parks as well. So definitely worthwhile if you plan to go to other Cedar Fair parks in the area. We love Kings Island as well. We love Michigan Adventure too. So between the three, we definitely usually make our rounds. So for us, it's definitely worth it to get the Prestige Plus Pass, um, but it's so much fun. We love Cedar Point. Make sure you get this pass if you feel like it's good for you. Um, there are payment plans to so check those out. Let us know in the comments if this would be worth it for you and your family. Um, what are the pros and cons to you? Let us know. Don't forget to like and subscribe and thanks for watching. And I think my favorite perk, I'm torn on so many perks from this, this prestige plus pass, but I think my favorite, one of my favorite perks is this preferred parking. Just going back to that, it's the end of the night, we're exhausted and our car is right here. It's taking us approximately one minute to get to our car, which is amazing.